We all struggle with confidence from time to time. Whispers of self-doubt may occasionally haunt us while preparing for a business proposal, awful memories of that speech in ninth grade may creep us in the middle of a job interview, and the list goes on, and so does life. Need a little boost of self-esteem? Well, you're in for a treat. Welcome back to another video. Today, we'll get those slouching back straight and poker faces smiling because we're going to talk about top psychology tricks to build amazing confidence. <laughs> Number 1. Accept compliments. What do you do when a friend compliments your dress tonight? Or when a visitor praises your artworks? Do you easily shy out and invalidate those nice words, saying that it's not really that good? This is one of the things that we do that sucks out the confidence within us. When we avoid compliments, it's because we subconsciously think of ourselves that way, that we don't deserve such. Instead of trying to down yourself in the picture, a simple thank you is enough to acknowledge the compliment, and at the same time, affirm yourself that you have wonderful qualities worth of recognition. Nope, it's not being arrogant, it's just you seeing the beauty of your strengths. Number 2. Smile. Always wear that shining smile. Even if you don't feel like to. A smile tricks your brain to release endorphins, which are hormones that make you feel happier, so fake it until you make it. They are also the universal way to show to others that you're happy, that you are confident in them, and that you are friendly and approachable. Smiling creates an outward positive and engaging vibe to the people around you. With that smile on your face, they are more likely to respond warmly and positively towards you, which in turn improves your own self-confidence. Number 3. Stand tall. You know a confident person when you see one right? A straight back, open gestures, and a confident walk, these are all signs of confidence. It's because slouching subconsciously means that we are hiding, protecting our core from the outside world to see. So, to build up some boost of confidence, keep your head raised, keep your back straight, and look up, instead of down. You will soon feel different. Research shows that the body language of a confident person decreases their level of stress. Number 4. Exercise. Squeeze in a brief exercise in your busy schedule. Doing physical activities increases endorphins, dopamine and adrenaline which are brain chemicals that make you feel happy, confident, less anxiety and stress and even less physical pain. You can become more positive and increase your confidence just by becoming more active. Even as little as 7 minutes a day exercise will break up negative thoughts and reduce stress and anxiety and improve sleep and happiness, so you'll not only feel good but also look good. This positive response adds to your self-esteem and confidence. Number 5. Mark your achievements. It's easy to go on a spiral of self-doubt and negative thinking for just one mistake. It can blind you out of all the good things you've done for the day, so try to keep track of your achievements. Make a diary or a checklist of the good things you've done for the day and write down new ones every day, be it small or big. For example, maybe you've finished 10 pages from your favorite book, reached a new goal in your fitness app and so on. When you remind yourself that you have multiple reasons to be proud of who you are, you can get back up with more confidence. Number 6. Help someone. There is more happiness in giving than there is in receiving. That is also very much true in building up your confidence. Acting selflessly, donating, or volunteering, or by simply putting out the effort to help someone else, you know that you matter to that person and no one could ever take that away from you. It creates a sense of purpose, improves your social skills, relieves stress and injects a healthy dose of positivity into your life. It also doesn't hurt that volunteering stimulates a rush of oxytocin, otherwise known as the compassion hormone which is usually released when hugging or cuddling with a loved one. Number 7. Stop comparing. There will always be someone better than you, but that doesn't mean you can't be the best in your own ways. Comparing is the greatest thief of happiness and confidence. Looking at countless pictures of beautiful people and amazing lifestyles, it's easy to start comparing and feel insecure, which can be detrimental to your self-confidence because those fancy expensive things begin to seem like a necessity just to catch up. This next part might sound a bit cliché but it couldn't be truer. Every person is unique, and has the potential to reach their own kind of success. 
There is no point in comparing yourself to all those kinds of people because you will never be them. You will only ever be you so embrace the gifts that you do have and use them to the fullest as only you can. Number 8. Maintain eye contact in conversations. When you look at a person in the eye, you communicate confidence and belief in your point of view. One of the most powerful means of communicating confidence and conviction is focused eye contact. When someone avoids eye contact, it means that they are not self-confident. So, maintaining eye contact with people will help you to win their trust and convince them that you are honest. Well, there you have it folks. Success is what you make it, so doing the right thing is the key. What do you think of these common habits that successful people have? <laughs>